Hey, hey, welcome back to Big Board. Here we are looking at Great Battles of History, the Alexander the Great module. Uh, we're looking at the Diadoce Deluxe module that's inside. And it's the Battle of, uh, uh, now depending on how you want to pronounce this, because Italians would say uh, Paratacine, uh, but Australians would say uh, Paratacine, or Cine, anyway. Set in uh, 317 BC, it's part of the, the post Alexander uh, Alexander uh, battles uh, for supremacy, and it's Eumenes versus Antiochus, Antigonus. Sorry, I should say. And end of the first turn, the uh, Eumenes was very aggressive with his elephants. He brought them in all along this line along here, and as you can see. Uh, that has not worked out well for him, but uh, even worse for uh, for Antigonus. So um, it's a deadly. And what then happened is over here on the on this flank, uh, this leader here. What is his name? Python. He um, activated three or four of the Median lances and some heavy calf and cleaned up the two or three elephants that were here by doing uh, rear uh, attacks on them, and then also straightened out this line and extended the line so that it's now beyond uh, the uh, Eumenes uh, cavalry line. Now these are pretty tough little guys here, so this is probably, this might not go well, we'll see. Historically, these guys broke through Eumenes uh, line and then went uh, uh, and attacked the, the baggage camp and cause all sorts of mayhem but in the meantime the elephants and uh, other forces uh, really gave a, a licking to uh, to Antigonus's forces where we're at though is now we've got Eumenes main line closing in we've got a double phalanx line uh, hoplite line here uh, oppos uh, opposing them. Uh, here there are silver shields and the hippasis and all that. Uh, all the tough kind of their single hex uh, sized phalanx units right there. And you know they've got all these skirmishes and elephants left here still and they are probably going to cause a few challenges for both sides as they try to close with each other. Now uh, What's going to go on here, I'm not really sure. See, it feels like these cavalry elements are a little bit out of position. These uh, elephant units have moved up in a, in a kind of a column line, uh, up and forward. These guys all moved up and forward a little bit, just a tad. Uh, but I, I suspect that if, uh, if things go well, we'll see this cavalry attack the flanks of these units here or potentially... The main, uh, the main hoplite line, and try and beat up on that a little bit. So that's kind of what's going on. I'll check in a little bit later on in turn two, uh, and we'll uh, go for it from there. Ciao.